play a movie about my life, Julia Roberts would definitely have to play me. Largely because of what she did with Aaron Brockovich, and I can relate a whole lot to that character. The way that I would explain what I did to a five-year-old, first of all, I just told them that I saved the world every day. They're five. What do they know? They'll believe me. But to be serious, I would have to tell them that what I do is I check everyone's work, same as you know their teacher does, before they showed it to all their friends. This way they make sure it's right and make sure that it's perfect. My best day at work so far has actually been in preparing for this whole interview. I was speaking to one of the managers here, Kelly Weems, about you know how hers went and what to do and what to expect while she was trying to make coffee. Kelly does not make coffee. Kelly does not drink coffee. Watching Kelly try to work the coffee machine to make the coffee is one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. So if you see her, definitely ask her to go make you a pot of coffee and just watch her while she does it. One thing I can't live without here is my headphones and music. It gets a little repetitive looking at the number of jobs that we churn through every day. Nothing helps drowning out any outside conversations or distractions like having some Bon Jovi blaring in your ears or even some classical music to help me really just get my focus on and get through the day, get everything done correctly and efficiently. <laughs> if I won 20 million in the lottery, contrary to popular belief, I would not just drop everything and follow the Backstreet Boys around on tour. That would be on the list though. I would be responsible first, hook myself up with a very good financial planner, and then go traveling and everything and probably follow the Backstreet Boys on tour. Oh, I love the Backstreet Boys. I love the new kids on the block. I love insane. Backstreet.